I went to the dentist last week. No problems. Well, well, no problems. I mean, you know, somewhat, you know, one, once a year I go to the dentist now, you know. But what happened was I went to the dentist, and my dentist, my well, my dentist passed away, December. I didn't know that, you know. And then, you know, so I had a new dentist, but it got me to thinking, this is the problem with getting older. I mean, it could be a problem in younger in South Africa, because people pass away all the time. You'll go to funerals all the time. Mm -hmm. But I mean, the thing about getting, you know, getting old is that, you know, you have friends and stuff and relationships, whatever it is, and people pass. So, you know, so I'm, well, that's one of the problems of getting old, you know, it's, 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 it's what it is. But see, other there's a lot of things about getting old. Now, one thing I realize is that I'm getting just more con cantankerous, as they say, as I get older. I'm getting, I won't say less patience. I have patience, but I have a patience to a point. I'll give an example. This past weekend, we had the big uh, game, rival game between the, uh, the Orlando Pirates and the Kaiser City Chiefs, you know. I'm not into soccer and stuff like that, but I knew I was gonna be around a bunch of Chiefs guys. So I, I so so I, I, my, my woman made me a patch, you know, a Pirates patch, right? And I went with the boys and sat with the game. So I was like a pirate among the Chiefs. Now here's the thing that came up with, that I came away with. It was a for me it was a good game, okay? It was a draw, it was a, you know, nil nil, you know, as they say. But the Pirates played better. Now, the, now, when I listen to the sports and you know, well, listen to the morning, I, I listen to the radio in the morning, and I said, oh, but there was no, there was no goal scored. I'm going like, that's the problem with the world today. They got that. You got to be a winner and a loser. They don't have no appreciation for the process. I mean, government everything like that. Oh, I won. I lost. You know, and, and it drives me crazy. But here's what. Let me tell you what happened when we when after the game. You know. You know, they're boys, you know what I mean? So I say boys, you know, they're men. So they're, they're into sports. But I, but, but the, the, one of the guys there, who one of the hosts, he's always asking me stuff about, you know, about stuff, you know. And I'm always trying to tell him, well, go here, go there, like that. Well, I answer him, but he's not really listening, you know. And so after the game, uh, uh, about the time uh, on RT, Kaiser Report was coming on. So I said, look, watch Kaiser Report. So he was watching Kaiser Report. Oh, we, we want to watch the rugby. We watch, turn to the rugby, and it was like that. Whoever was playing, they were, you know, they were. I think it was the blue, uh, the, uh, the Bulls against uh, the Cheetahs. I like the Cheetahs. Anyway, the Bulls were, were going to win. There's no problem. There's not, nothing to watch. You can watch at the end, get the highlights. I took it back. I said, you know, y'all should be watching this. You know. So, then, uh, so we got into this. I don't say argument. I started. He said, you know, I said that's the problem. You keep on asking me about America or the state of the world, and but you spend all your time with this win-lose situation. You refuse. You just refuse. The stuff is out there. You refuse to look up other sources. Take you know some time, twenty minutes out of your day, and get some new knowledge. You don't want to do that. So I started yelling at him. Oh boy, I just got, he came and said, I said, Kaiser Report. What the stuff is here? You got the internet. You got the internet. You're internet savvy. You're supposed to be looking at other stuff. But all you do is watch these videos of people shaking their behinds and sports. It's there was a great program on TV called or on HBO called The Wire. At one at one point, uh, uh, there was a police officer that got knocked out of out of the office. Then he went to work for this lawyer. So he's with the lawyer's office, and the lawyer's little because the paper says, "Oh, do you you know see this headline?" I said, "What headline?" He said, "He said you should pay attention to the paper because you know our client is blah blah blah." He said, and he pulls up the paper, and said, "If it's not in the sports section, I don't want to know." That's the problem. You get groomed into these things, and you don't want new knowledge, especially stuff that's going to affect you. Mm -hmm. So I was just terrible. Now here's the thing. I just wanted to say this. I don't know. I'll end it here. I'm the kind of guy. But I'm cool to a point. But if you keep on, yeah, I, I guess he was also a victim of a few days earlier, these political clubs outside you know, that I see it on campus ask me some questions. The same thing, they're always trying to ask you a question and don't want really an answer. They just want to get a rise out of you. There's always this confrontation thing. So I'm just through. From now on, what people say to me, I'm going to say, Kaiser Report. <laughs>
Because right now, I think the economics is the, is, the, is the main thing. The main thing is the economics. I'm not going to go to anything else. Let me not say, cut the report. That's all I'm going to say. Because it, I'm not going to engage in these back and forth because they don't really want to hear. Even if they hear you, then they dismiss it or they want to take opposition. And they don't know, they don't know what they're opposing to. They don't, they don't know the, what they're talking about. So anyway, let me stop because I see I'm getting upset already. Let me stop because this well, look, this has been one of those dispatches from the arts director murders. That would be me, T, from the Pattersons, taking the train to Tibet, letting you know what I only suspect. Kaiser Report. <laughs>